If it wasn't for the wonderful audience that it is, I don't know if I would take this 18-hour flight over here. But it's all worth it when I get here because, like, whether I'm in Melbourne or whether I'm in Perth or whether I'm in Sydney or whether I'm in Gold Coast or whatever, the audience is, they're party animals. And collaborations, my collaborations with the audience, those are my biggest collaborations. Yeah. Everything else is just business. Out there, that's, that's like pure love right there. Push me, cause I'm close to the edge. I'm trying not to lose my head. <laughs> it's like a jungle sometimes, it makes me wonder how I keep from going under. It's like a jungle sometimes, it makes me wonder how I keep from going under. I'm a character in the latest a sequel to Guitar Hero, which is DJ Hero. So that's out now. I'm working on a new album. Um, I just got a, a, a radio, a, a international radio station uh, position. It's going to be broadcast worldwide on Sirius XM Radio. So you'll be able to get it out here as well. So I got my hands on a couple of things. And of course, I'm a dad, you know, which that's first. So what's the best advice as dad? There's no manual. Like the kids, when they come out, it's no manual. They just, yeah. they become what they become. And you just do the best to make sure that they are loved and cared for and Absolutely. all that good stuff. I, I say to my kids, love what you do. Whether it's a DJ, doctor, lawyer, machinist, whatever. And if you love what you do, it'll take care of you for the rest of your life. A guy such as myself, who started in my bedroom in 1973, would never imagine that I would be coming out here and playing in front of thousands of people. No way, no how. Couldn't fathom it in a million years. Yeah. So being here and traveling internationally and being one of the architects of this culture we call hip hop. It's your boy DJ Grandmaster Flash and you're watching Speaker TV.